Hi guys, Dan's Dollars here. Here we go then. We're back with £100 of 50p's. This week then, what a run we have had. 77 commemorative 50p coins found on the channel. This is the penultimate coin hunt of the week. £100 here. We're finishing off in a couple of hours with £250. We might not need it. We're in the first bag. It's quiet. I can feel the tension. The tension. As we pick up both Vic Cross coins, lovely jubbly. There we go, the Victoria Cross Heroic Sack, the Victoria Cross Medal back to back. Surely there, somebody has handed in those coins. We're just going to give it a little bit of zoom here in the Dan's Dollars household, getting you that premium quality in these videos. You can tell I'm probably excited. I am like a kid. I really am when it comes down to finding these coins, and that's the way it should be as well. Fun and exciting. I'm trying to hit a target like this and maybe get in it. 100 coins. Come on. Can we do it? As always, any questions, queries, let us know in the comment section. Again, really on a roll. One off 80. We've had some really nice finds as well. One Olympic, Floresia Flower, pl plenty of Battle of Britons. The most common coin. Is the Mr. Jeremy Fisher currently? He is one in the lead, taking on the Miss Tiggy Winkle and the Benjamin Bunny. Just behind those, though, three in the middle. Diversity, peace, prosperity, and friendship with all nations. And also the Johnson's Dictionary getting in on the action, trying to be the most found coin on the channel this week. Plenty of time to go. We could even find a full bag of the same coin if that was the case. I'm sure that coin will come out on top. As always, I do like to ask a question in these coin hunt videos. And here it is. My question to you is, have you ever found a full bag? Ooh, Benjamin Bunny. I'll sign the back of it. I'll try and clean that one up a little bit first. But Benjamin Bunny, back level. With the Mr. Jeremy Fisher. My question to you then is, have you ever found a full bag of the same commemorative coin? Maybe it was Paddington's Benjamin Bunnies. Maybe it was at the start of your coin hunting journey. Let us know in the comment section, have you ever found a full bag of the same 50p? Obviously, it'll be in a coin hunt. You're not going to get a full bag of same as hit out in your change from the shop. However, you may have got plenty of the same coin in your change. There we go. Just so everyone can answer. Maybe you've, maybe you've hit a few of the same commemorative in your change. Somebody may have just put the full bag in the till. So they could have maybe given you the change. A few Mr. Jeremy Fishers, for example. Let us know in the comments if that has happened. The Sherlock Holmes is up next. A little bit of a mucky one again. And it does look like we're going to hit on 2016 with the Beatrix Potter Anniversary. Here I am muttering along and we are finding coin after coin after coin. The stage looks like it is definitely going to be set for us to try and get that 100 with the 250 this evening. Again, hope you've enjoyed all the videos. There's been quite a lot of content on the channel over this week. I do understand that. If you've watched it all, I really do salute you. Hope you do enjoy it. And again... When it comes down to videos on the channel, if you would like to see a specific kind of video, please do let me know and I'll try my best to make that for you. Maybe you want some more games, some more in-depth coin reviews. Just let us know exactly what you're thinking and I will try my best to make that happen. 2014 50p there, trying to destroy the commemoratives that we found this week. Get it back in check. Get it back in as we find another Beatrix Potter. What is going on here again? All of them do seem to be quite dirty, which therefore does make me think that possibly somebody has cashed in some of their common coins. Just a quick back stretch there. As we move on, three more bags to go. You can always tell in these as soon as you open them if there is any of, say, the newer coins because they are made completely different than what they used to be. Again, we've touched on those commemoratives these days wearing so quickly compared to the old ones. So if you do have any of those maybe made in the last five years since they've changed them, last five years, if you've got them in perfect quality, keep them that way 
because again, coins definitely don't stay in the same quality as they used to, which therefore means perfect quality coins will be worth more just because there's less of them out there. On to the penultimate bag we go, Shields Britannias. As always, at the end of the coin on video, I will check through all of the coins again with me waffling on so much. Probably do miss them. If not, I'll look for any errors on the coins. Red eights. If there is any of those, you'll see them at the start of the next coin hunt video. Here we go then. Final bag of the 100. Just one more coin hunt to go after this one. We've made it to the end of the weekend. And again, coins to one side. Hope you've all had an amazing one. Seven commemoratives then. We started the party on 77. We finish on 84. We need 16 commemoratives from the final coin hunt tonight. Maybe not get there. It's going to be close. Definitely stay tuned for half seven this evening. Seven in this one, the Victoria Cross coins. Come on, Dan. Let's kind of put them together in the set, shall we? Just to show them off. Right, there we go. Victoria Cross Heroics Act, Victoria Cross Medal, the, 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 the uh, braces there, blah, 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 blah. Victoria Cross Heroics Act, Victoria Cross Medal, and the Sherlock Holmes. Four at the top, the Tom Kitten, the Beatrix Potter Anniversary, the Taylor Peter Rabbit, and the Benjamin Bunny. I'll sign the back of that bunny. We're seven closer. 16 to find from 250. It's going to be close. Stay tuned, half seven this evening. Can we get to the 100? We'll find out then. Stay safe. And as always, guys, thanks for watching.